dearest wife, Sumaya. Today I give you my hand in marriage, my life and my own. I am so excited to spend today, tomorrow and the rest of my life with you by my side. Peace, don't forget I saved your life. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen Wa salatu wa salamu ala ashrafil khalqi wal mursaleen Sayyidina Muhammadin wa ala alihi wa sahbihi ajma'in I greet everyone with the most beautiful greeting The greeting of Islam as well as the greeting of Jannah Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh Alhamdulillah All praise is due to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala Who affords us once again on such a day of Rahmah, such a day whereby two beautiful individuals and two families will get together inshallah ta'ala for, this, for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Such a day whereby they will practice one of the greatest sunan of our anbiya, the sunnah of marriage, the sunnah of nikah, the sunnah that the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, he mentions that an nikahu min sunnati, that nikah is from my sunnah, it is my way of life. Nikah is half of our faith. It is not a contract which only bind two people, but it brings two families together. Is that not what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala desire from us? Lita'arafu, get to know one another. We're going to have differences, but we can still live beautifully with one another. We are honored to, to say today that the father of the bride will be the wali inshallah and he will also perform the nikah inshallah ta'ala may Allah place barakah in it inshallah amin Allahumma salli ala sayyidina muhammadin wa ala ali sayyidina muhammadin wa ashabihi wa barik wa sallim bismillahirrahmanirrahim bismillahirrahmanirrahim uzawwijuka أزوجك على ما على ما أمر الله أمر الله به به من إمساك من إمساك بمعروف بمعروف أو تسريح أو تسريح بإحسان بإحسان يا محمد إلياس يا محمد إلياس زوجتك زوجتك وأنكحتك وأنكحتك مخطوبتك مخطوبتك المسونة المسونة سمية سمية بنتي بنتي بما تراديتما بما تراديتنا عليه عليه من المهر من المهر وقدره وقدره قبلت نكاحها لنفسي بذلك
to my love Elias. Alhamdulillah, we are finally here. We made it to the starting point of a lifelong journey together and I could not be more happy to have you as my partner for the start of this new chapter in our lives. Wow, am I lucky that the breathtaking voice I heard that day was matched to a handsome gentleman I came to know. I am lucky to have met someone who ticks all the boxes, not only in my eyes but in the eyes of my parents and I am truly grateful that our paths crossed. We have known each other for almost half our lives and I am excited to tackle the rest of our lives hand in hand. I make dua that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala strengthens our bond and keeps us on each other's side through every hurdle we might face. I know we make a great team and I am grateful to have a life partner like you. You've taught patience how to love fearlessly and that everything will be okay if we just work together. to always have you back, to support you in all that is good for you and to love you abundantly. May our marriage be filled with laughter, happiness, understanding and most importantly the remembrance of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in all that we do. I love you and I look forward to loving you more and more each day. Your wife, Sumaya. To my dearest wife, Samaya, you stepped into my life 10 years ago. From the moment that I laid eyes on you, I felt an abundance of love and affection. Your warm presence and kind nature touched my heart. We have grown up together from getting to know each other at the youth league camp to guiding and supporting each other throughout our career paths. I thank the Almighty Allah for placing you in my life, granting our wish pouring love into our hearts and granting me a wife as beautiful, patient and kind as you are. This is just the beginning of creating a lifetime of memories. I look forward to waking up next to you in the morning, having breakfast in bed, walking with you by my side, coming home to you, sitting around our dinner table, having curry and rice. I look forward to the death stares and eye rolls as I irritate you. I remember inviting you about 10 years ago on Mixit, the first ever app I had on my prepaid Sony Ericsson K850. I will never forget how you deleted me a million times and I kept re-inviting you and running after you. But I am so happy that I persevered through the rejection and today I stand proudly calling you my wife. Thank you for making me laugh as much as you do, putting a smile on my face each and every day, filling my life with happiness, 
showering me with unconditional love and being my better half. I'm thankful for the person that you are and the way you were raised. I appreciate you. You complete me and I aspire to be like you. As each day goes by, I love you more and more. You are everything I have ever dreamt of and so much more. I make to us that we will always be as respectful to each other as we have been. I make to us that he protects you, guides you through all the challenges that we that we encounter grows us from strength to strength and places love, contentment and mercy in our lives. I look forward to all the exciting adventures to come our way. I am so excited to spend today, tomorrow and the rest of my life with you by my side. I love you forever and always, your husband Elias. P.S. Don't forget I saved your life. <laughs> I swear to God when I come home I'm gonna hold you so close I swear to God when I come home I'll never let go Like a river I flow To the ocean I know You pull me close Guiding me home I swear to God I can see Four kids in no sleep We'll have one on each knee You and me mm. And when they've grown up You're still the girl in the club When I held your hair up Cause you had so much You have always been there for me when I needed you the most and I am who I am because of you. I know that we'll grow together to achieve great things, to reach for the stars and to conquer the world. And I will finally be walking down the aisle with you in just a few moments. Oh, my love. Oh, my love. Oh, my love. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. On behalf of Mr. and Mrs. Mushtaq and Shireen Parker, as well as Mr. and Mrs. Ismail and Karima Kaida, 
I wish to welcome each and every one of you seated here today. The wedded couple are finally ready to make the entrance. I humbly request for the utmost of silence as we give these two individuals the reception they so rightfully deserve. One last round of applause for Mr. and Mrs. Parker. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. All praise and glory be to Almighty Allah, the Lord of all worlds. We praise Him and glorify Him in the way that He ought to be praised and glorified. May peace and salutations be upon all his noble and honored messengers, and in particular, the last messenger of them all, Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, our exemplar, savior, and leader in this life and the next. I would like to congratulate my brother, Ilyas, and Sumeya on their marriage. I make to her that the Almighty grants them a marriage filled with happiness, prosperity, contentment, mercy, and understanding. Amen. Writing down the contents of our speech, the heading was called Good Luck Ilias. So here it goes. This family can be quite dramatic, but I can tell you that when we are all in the same room, the love and unity is palpable. I would say welcome to our family, but you've been a part of this family for so long that this transition just feels natural. I look forward to all the memories we'll make and I hope you are ready to deal with Appa, Tasneem and I for the rest of your life because like we've said, there is no turning back now. To be honest, not much is going to change now that you're married to my sister because quite honestly, for the past few years, you have been like a second brother to me. Inshallah, with this new chapter, our bond as brother and sister continue to grow. Thank you for everything that you have done for me. And to you, it may seem as though you haven't done much. But believe me, the impact you have had on my life has been huge. You and Appa continue to be such great role models to me. Welcome to the family and I can't wait for all the memories to come and figuring out new ways to annoy Appa. 